I'm Colin, and in this video, we're gonna talk about how to remove leaf stains and tree sap from pavers. Now the stains from leaves on a concrete surface, whether it's wet cast concrete or paving stones, are prevalent because of the tannins in those leaves. And without getting too scientific, the tannins are an astringent that bonds with the alkaloids in the cement in your concrete products at a molecular level. In short, just making them a little bit more challenging to remove. The ways we typically remove tannins or leaf stains on our concrete surfaces is with either four to one bleach and water, maybe a little bit heavier depending on the stains, or if that doesn't work, we'll move to a hot water pressure washer or at least some boiling water that's above 220 degrees Fahrenheit to make easy work of removing those natural organic stains. Now in the less than optimal circumstance that a tree that emits sap is overhanging your concrete surface or paving stones, you will obviously have an accumulation of tree sap that is not very functional or aesthetically pleasing to your project. What we do to remove tree sap from concrete products is first we take a plastic putty knife or tool and we gently scrape away the bulk of that sap to get us down to a nice thin layer. Then we'll use one of two chemicals. The first one being something acetone based like nail polish remover, pure acetone, or sometimes goof off. You put this material on a cotton ball or a paper towel or a shop rag and gently work at that layer of what's left of that tree sap, it'll eventually start to degrade and wear away. If that isn't doing the trick, if it's a little bit tougher of a tree sap stain, then you can move to xylene, which is basically going to do the same thing, but at a heavier duty process. So again, we're gonna get it on a cotton ball, a shop rag, or a paper towel, and work at that layer of the leftover tree sap until it's completely gone. But the nice part about both these chemicals is they won't do any harm to your concrete surface, and they will evaporate once they've soaked into the concrete when the tree sap is gone, making it easy clean. We hope that one of these methods has helped you remove these organic stains that both come from trees so you can enjoy your outdoor living space some more. If you have any outdoor projects involving hardscape coming up this season, make sure you check out our YouTube channel for all of the great and structural videos we have.